In a year where we've seen so many individuals on the move as the future of work gets contemplated, perhaps more distributed, the office maybe not what it once was. Brian Sazi, one company is picking up and moving from Silicon Valley down to Texas. That's right, Miles. Uh, and that company is Hewlett Packard Enterprises. Going from San Jose, California, they announced last night on their uh, on their earnings release they're moving to Houston, Texas. Uh, and this is pretty big. Let's keep in mind here, Hewlett Packard uh, was founded in 1939 uh, by Bill Hewitt and David Packard uh, in Palo Alto. And they are seen as the really the founders of Silicon Valley. So a big move here by Hewlett Packard Enterprises. But you know, I talked to uh, HPE's CEO, Antonio Neri, a couple of months ago, uh, and we talked about his view of the world post-pandemic and, and his view of his employee base post-pandemic. Here's what he told Yahoo Finance. We're gonna live in a much more distributed enterprise than ever before. Uh, the, uh, the workforce of the future will change dramatically. Uh, and so that distributed model needs to be supported by technologies that accelerate the digital transformation. So anything associated with virtual desktop, uh, connectivity, obviously security, uh, we see uh, significant strength. And really what Neri is, is saying here, uh, Julie, is that we're going to be working potentially from anywhere after we all get vaccines, not necessarily just our home. So I'm really not surprised to see them do this. Also keep in mind, HPE has been aggressively cutting expenses. They, by the end of fiscal 2022, they will have cut $800 million in expenses out of their model compared to fiscal 19. Now, no layoffs as part of this move, but this is a company that remains very focused on cutting expenses improving their profits and moving forward. Sazi, I thought it was interesting. You could see uh, there was a fake background in that, uh, I guess, Skype or Zoom shot, whatever that was for part of that interview. Uh, I guess speaking to what the future of the office is going to look like, it's going to look like uh, whatever background you surprise us with in the morning meeting every day at six o'clock. Uh, today, of course, a festive design that we'll, uh, we'll discuss later on in the program.